Hello friends, welcome to CrackGate CSE and in this new series of programming and data structure, today we are going to analyze the detailed syllabus of this particular subject. So now let us try to understand that which particular topics are important and what we have to cover in this entire subject with respect to gate, any PSU exam or with respect to net as well because the syllabus of the programming and data structure is almost same in all these three things that is gate, PSU and your net exam. So without wasting time let's try to analyze the topics that we have to read and what are the things that we have to cover so before going to any of the uh, before going to the further discussion please go and subscribe my channel press that bell icon as well so that you can get the notification of each and every new videos that i am uploading so now start with the discussion of, on the syllabus of programming and data structure first thing what we have to cover is we have to cover the basics of programming that is what 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 i mean by the basics is what are the different data types we have what is the precedence of the operator that is addition subtraction there are, there are so many operators in the programming language so we have to know the associative whether they are right to left or left to right and also we have to know the precedence of the operator this will help us in solving any of the program or any of the equations that you have within the program the third thing which have to cover is storage classes there are different storage classes like auto register extern static so these kind of storage classes can be asked in exam so we have to cover that as well apart from that this thing the important thing is that we have to cover static scoping and dynamic scoping and the parameter passing techniques the parameter passing techniques can be there in your exam there are chances that one or two questions from there either from the scoping or from the parameter passing so the second chapter which we have to deal with is recursion in recursion we are going with the application of recursion first of all which are factorial fibonacci tower of hanoi gcd any greatest common divisor of two numbers finding maximum or minimum value you can say next thing which we have to learn is we have to learn the declaration and notations that there are several uh, there are several declarations which can be asked in exam which will be having four options of uh, the four options will be explaining the basic meaning of that particular declaration so these kind of questions has been asked in the previous also and they can be asked in future also so i will be giving you around 20 to 30 examples of that particular thing so that you will be fluent with the declaration and notations next thing is array and linked list one of the important topic in data structure here we will be dealing with 2d array 3d array singly linked list double linked list and what are the operations that we have to perform on the linked list so the third chapter deals with this array linked list and the operations on that similarly the fourth array fourth array is dealing with the stack and queues here also we are going to analyze the application of stack application of queues and queue operation, DQ operation, insertion in stack and deletion in stack and how to convert these to how to perform a stack using queue. These kind of questions can be I will be discussing in this particular chapter. So this is one of the all this is one of the important subjects. The question has been asked in this particular thing in 2018 as well, 2019 as well, and in 17 as well. So this is one of the most important topic which the organizing student considering into the exam so next thing will be trees bst binary heap and graph most of the things i will be discussing in the uh, algorithm as well if you want to refer the algorithm videos you can just go to the, my playlist and i have uploaded several videos of algorithm as well so you can just go and check check out those videos uh, i haven't uploaded this particular section for this uh, heap and trees but you will be getting the videos regarding the heap short other shorting algorithm so basically the dividing conquer part in algorithm has been covered and the rest of the part will be i will be covering soon so i have to cover in this particular subject as well in data structure i will be covering the definition and properties of all these things what are the travel server techniques that is in order and in order pre-order post-order that will be covered in this particular series of videos the next thing is bsg which is binary search tree 
So I will be discussing that how to insert, how to delete a particular node in a binary search tree. So that will be covered here. Heap tree is exact pretty same as algorithm, but I will cover here itself as well so that you can have to, you can just um, go with the flow without just going to the algorithm playlist and here. And next thing is AVL search trees. So AVL search tree is also one of the important thing because of the problems that occurs in AVL like red rotation, left rotation, LR, LR problems. So these kind of problems, because of these kind of problems, this topic is one of the important topics in data structure. So several students asked me about the marks distribution. The marks distribution of this particular subject is 12 to 15. But I will let you know that in the past the subject have subject is of 8 marks that means the questions based on this particular subject varies time to time in some previous year it has it was asked just for 8 marks and in some it was asked for 18 marks so just don't go with this particular stats these are just the rough, rough estimation but you have to read all of the topics all of the topics are equally important the books that you have to refer in case of any problem in case you are having any doubt in any of the topic in that case only you have to refer the books so there are two books one is the, one of the standard book of Dennis M. Ritchie and Kernaghan the name of the book is the C programming and another book that I found which is very useful with respect to gate is classic data structure this is the book by Devasi Samanta. This is one of the important book because it explains each topic with the help of an example which makes it easy to understand with respect to gate as well. So in the next videos we will be covering the rest of the sections of this particular subject. Till then keep supporting, keep learning, subscribe my channel and please uh, go to the comment section and let me know what particular things I have to cover first with respect to this subject. Thank you. Have a great day.